at number one, we got Sparty from Michigan State. I really, I like the detail that they put in the Funko Pop. And it's just super cool. It's super realistic. So I think the Funko Pops are going to win this round. At number two, we have the Clemson mask guy. I don't know the name, but I really like the detail that they put into this. Like the stripes, the nice uh, claws and the shirt. So I think the Funko Pops are going to win this round too. At number three, we got the mascot for LSU. I like the the Funko Pop so good because like, it has such realistic, realistic to the mascot. So I think the Funko Pops are also going to win this round too. At number four, we got the mascot for Alabama. Um, the detail is nice. It's really cool, but the trunk isn't really the same. The ears aren't that the same. So I think the mascots are going to win this round. At number five, we got Brutus Buckeye. I really uh, like how they really detailed the shirt and everything for the Funko Pop. They have the hat. The skin tone is pretty good. So I'm going to give this round to the Funko Pops. At number six, we have the mascot for Georgia, Harry Dog. I think uh, this round might go to the mat or Funko Pops because I really like the detail and the teeth and everything, the jersey. So, yeah. At number seven, we have Tommy or Tommy the Trojan. I actually got to give this one to the um, mascots because he's way more buff in the arm. And last but not least, number eight, Ramesses from University of North Carolina, Chapel Hill, I think. So I, I think this uh, might go to the mascots because for the Fungal Pop, it's not as realistic because the, um, the horns are way more yellow and like the paws and stuff like that it's a way too wider